All right, I'm really excited to introduce you to our next guest. Her name is Claire Hines, and she started designing jewelry and then handbags years ago, but she had no idea that what she was creating would change more than just her own life. But living in the Philippines and discovering the weavings and fabrics done by local women inspired her to create accessories incorporating traditional designs. So she started Soli and Son and then began employing those very same women. Claire, now living here in Sammamish, joins me in the studio. I am so Hi. excited to hear your story. Uh, we're going we're gonna to talk about all these handbags. Don't you worry in just a moment. But first, um, let's talk about the women whose work that you feature and who actually construct these beautiful bags. Yeah, so um, the weaving that we use in our bags is done by women from the Taboli tribe, mm -hmm. and they're in southern Philippines. Um, and this is the rattan that's used. And then we have um, a group of artisans who work in the workshop who construct the bags as well. And we're looking at some of the pictures of your artisans right now doing yeah. this. It is amazing how it's all handmade. Nothing's machine made. There's a lot of love that goes into each one of these bags. Yes, absolutely. And when I lived in the Philippines and I discovered um, these weavings mm -hmm. and fabrics, I just absolutely fell in love with them and wondered had a dream of how I could incorporate them into my designs and so created into your handbags. everyday life. It's, <laughs> yeah. it's taking a piece of that. How has your company and this work changed these women's lives? And men as well, I understand. Yes, absolutely. So, well, the obviously the wage that they get from the, the weavings um, helps to in, improve their life and their children and the next generation um, and their community and also helps to um, keep their tradition alive and mm -hmm. showcase their beautiful work through our designs. I think yeah. the true, I mean, it's incredible to see Thank this. You. you know, it's interesting because we've seen these weavings before. I don't think many people know where it originally comes from. Yeah. And you know, a lot of folks in your position may have seen this, taken the idea, and then taken it to a factory to duplicate it. Yeah. Um, cheaply. But that was yeah. never a consideration for uh, you, which is oh, what I love. Yeah, absolutely not, no. Um, I think it's so important um, to keep that tradition alive mm -hmm. and to see like the intric intricacy of how the weaving's created. Oh, I think it's, I personally think it's just beautiful, yeah. And seeing a family all working together yeah. and friends, and be, I, I think it is beautiful to see that and then to have this. So let's take a look at some of these bags because yeah. now that we've talked about it, we all know these are more than just bags. There's a whole lot of love and yes. creativity and artistry in each one. Yeah. Yes, yeah, so actually I'm wearing one as well with a, everyone comes with a crossbody strap. Ooh, nice. And even this one, so these. This with the Yeah, little... with the shell inlay beads. So oh. all the beads as well as, um, come from the Philippines. And this is the separate artisan group who create each of these beads. I mean, I um, wish you all could see these. Up I mean, there's tiny little pieces of shell yeah. put together to make this beautiful pearl-like. Here we go, this pearl-like fabric. Look at how beautiful that is. Yeah. Unbelievable. Oh, that's so gorgeous. Um, so let's go down the line and yep. look at each bag, because I want to see. So yes. this is the bigger bag. What yes. is this so one this, called? This one's called the Isabella, and this is like the OG, my original design. Yes. Um, and if you see, with the rattan weave, um, it's called Solly here, which mm -hmm. is actually with, where the inspiration from for the for name. The Solly, so, yeah, okay. Yeah, And then this one's the Miller bag, and with a slightly different pattern wooden beaded handle. Mm -hmm. So you can tell the signature style is with these wooden beads as well. Yes. Um, and then this is a new style which is more of a, just a basic crossbody. So cute. Yeah. And then these two here, I, I designed for the holidays. I think they're a bit more fancy for the Christmas. The hand, yeah, but it and the still gold. has, it, but it's in different, I mean, these, these are absolutely gorgeous. What a beautiful gift to give someone for the holidays. And Thank then you. this is perfect for fall. I mean, I'm not going to so lie, this lovely. matches my <laughs> outfit perfectly. Yes, absolutely. I just have to say. Um, I do have a question, though. It yes. is important, especially when you have something with a natural uh, element to it. How do you care for these bags to make sure they stay in good shape? Yeah, well, I would just use, like, um, we call them like a wet wipe or okay. just um, some cool water and um, a cloth just to wipe, wipe down woodwork. Mm -hmm. Yeah. In addition to um, in addition to the wonderful work that you're doing and the artisans that you employ, I understand your design 
and their artisan work help push Soli and Son into boutiques all over the world. So this is not yes. just a Seattle thing. Yes. Does it mean uh, more to you than just a handbag, obviously? Absolutely. And really exciting this year, we've got into Four Seasons Resort. So oh, yes. So it's. Yeah, I'm just so excited. What started as a dream quite a few years ago has, has culminated in this and just to showcase their work to more people mm -hmm. um, is, is my aim and yeah, I hope to carry on doing that. Well, it seems like you will. Your heart is in the right place and obviously this is such beautiful design and fashion. We are so uh -huh. glad we got to meet you. We actually, you were featured by one of our stylists a long time yes, ago. Yes, Dawn, yes. And I, we were just enamored by, the, by the, the product and just how beautiful it was. So it's so great to finally have you here. It's so great to oh. hear your mission. Thank you so much for everything you do. Thank you so much, thank you. We'll have you back again, I, I know it. <laughs>